Hello gamers, welcome to Xbox Beyond the Box. I'm your host, Dragon Dust. Gamers, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for all the love and support that you show the channel each and every day. We really do appreciate it. Gamers, if you're new here, hit that like, share, and subscribe button to get future content from Xbox Beyond the Box. Damn, that takes a lot of air, y'all. But nonetheless, gamers, um, I guess the big thing right now is the gaming landscape is about to change, or at least it's rumored to. The big rumor right now is that Google is coming out with their own console. Now, for me, I'm still playing my Xbox uh, because basically there's a lot of free stuff on it. Uh, I know there's a lot of Microsoft trying to improve on the exclusives, but um, for the most part, I get my Xbox Live uh, Gold for free. I get my Xbox Game Pass for free all through uh, Microsoft points. That's the biggest reason I'm staying with them. That and the name's kind of kind of catchy for the channel. Um, now, personally, I do see Google as being a major threat to both Microsoft and Sony, and I know some of you are going, wait a minute, Dragon, Dragon, there's a third console. Oh, yeah, 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 um, let me think, uh, what was it called? Nintendo. Uh, you know, the guys that pretty much started it and then got left behind in it. Um, you know, if Google does hit us with a console, let's think about this for a little bit, y'all. Yeah. Google has a lot in the way of gaming. Granted, they you know they are more mobile games than anything, and to me, you know, mobile games are pretty much what started microtransactions in the first place. We'll, we'll open that can of worms later. But nonetheless, Google, you know, having a lot of uh, properties that they can use. Google, probably one of the big companies that could rival Microsoft as far as cash flow, and you know, people who would want to you know look at them and go, hey, Google. We're willing to give you exclusives and Google able to pay for it all. The only worry that I have, and this is the big one, is the name. I mean, let's face it, I don't know who in the hell is, you know, naming consoles nowadays. I don't know if a bunch of idiots are getting together and going, hmm, put them all in put all the names in a hat and see what we get. Or um, you know, somebody's you know, they put a bunch of uh, words on a wall blindfold somebody, give them a, a jackass tail to pin it, pin, pin it on the wall or something. But nonetheless, we've seen some stupid names. PlayStation so far has had it right. You know, they, they did the name thing right. They said, PlayStation, this is what it does. It's a station and it plays. Nintendo, however, uh, you know, I don't know what, what the fuck they were thinking. Nintendo. Okay, and then Super Nintendo. Then, of course, we moved on to N64, and none of these names were just making any sense. It sounded like, you know, pieces of hardware, more or less. You know, uh, Nintendo sounds like a Japanese ice cream maker. Uh, and, of course, the Switch, which basically, you know, you can switch between, um, what is it, mobile and uh, console. Oh, well, that's all well and good. But whoever came up with the Wii was a friggin' moron. And, of course, Xbox ain't much better. They started out with Xbox, which sounded like a porno machine. And then they went Xbox 360, which means we're turning it all around. Then Xbox One. Huh? So, Google, I I'm kind of wondering, you know, name? <laughs> what do you call it? Uh, the Google Box. No, don't sound right. Um, the Google Console, maybe. Oh, the G Spot. There's a name for a console. You know, it could stand for gaming. Uh, you know, the spot for gaming. Uh, it could stand for Google Spot. You know, just call it G Spot. The problem there is most men wouldn't be able to find it. Whoa, burn! For those of you all who didn't hear that, would you like to stand up and deliver that one? No. <laughs> Apparently, my wife says that the G Spot, there is a problem with that particular name. Apparently, most men could not find it. Uh, Y'all can leave your comments in the comment below on that one for my wife. Uh, <laughs> but um, nonetheless, I, I like the idea of, uh, you know, the whole uh, G-Spot thing. Maybe Google will run with that one. But nonetheless, gamers, what do you think if uh, Google decides to hit the market with a console? What do you think it'll be called? Leave a comment in the comment section below. And I will actually give a uh, shout out for the one who comes up with the best console name. Can't steal mine now. I did G Spot. Y'all have to come up with yeah. But I'll do a shout out in the next uh, gaming video for the person who comes up with the best uh, possible uh, Google console name. 
Uh, with that being said, gamers, it has been fantastic uh, to talk to you about this. Um, you know, I hope you like the video. If you do, hit give me a thumbs up there. Uh, leave a comment in the comment section below. And of course, as always, you know, share it with your friends there. Uh, we love hearing from you. With that being said, gamers, I wish you happy gaming. And until we meet again, this has been Xbox Beyond the Box. And of course, I've been your host, Dragon Dust. And the burn of the day was my wife. <laughs> wow. Y'all have a great one. I'm out of here.